What's up guys, welcome to the channel. I am Alina from Liar. We're producers and songwriters for acts like Itzy, Red Velvet, Purple Kiss, Kepler, and many more. And today I'm going to be reacting to ASAP and Cool With You by New Jeans. Now I've done quite a few reactions already to New Jeans. I think they're a really interesting group with a unique sound, really different from much of what's going on in K-pop. I'm gonna link those reactions down below, but without further ado, let's get into this video. I'm really excited to see it. Creepy rabbit person. Okay. I don't know if I like this. Let's just see what this is about. Oh, this is a cool style. Let's talk ASAP. They have the time. Let's talk ASAP, baby. Hurry up, don't be lazy. I like this track. This is something that is one of the reasons New Jeans really kind of pops out out of the other groups of K-pop artists for me is just the minimalism behind their tracks. A lot of their music is heavily inspired by UK styles of music like house, deep house, uh, garage, I always wanna say garage, <laughs> as well as some other dance styles like Baltimore Club and Jersey Club. Personally, for me, this is very new. I didn't grow up listening to any dance music. I never went to clubs. The few times that I've been to clubs have been like, traumatizing so it's interesting to discover these styles and get like deeper into them through new jeans okay those of you that do video please comment below and let me know what this style of video is called with like overlays of images that are almost like cropped out of paper i think it's so cool <laughs> Such pretty images. Oh, this part has got to blow up on TikTok just because it says TikTok, right? Oh, that's so pretty. Like the like woodland fairy imagery. <laughs> Oh, eyes. This is this is pretty addicting. Oh yeah, and then we get a full-on dance section that is also very minimalistic. This is so crazy to me, you guys. This is almost like anti-K-pop. It is so minimalistic. Like this section is literally drums. I don't, is there a bass? Is it in that little um, bell plug sync synth? Yeah, there's a, there, there's a, a bass or it's a synth with a really heavily featured bass frequency. Oh, that's gorgeous. I love that shot. ASAP, baby. Hurry up, don't be lazy. That's so cool. The the video, oh the ear, the elf ear. The video is like probably my favorite out of all the ones they've done just because it's so aesthetically pleasing and it is simple too. Having been a part of a lot of projects, major label and indie. I've been on quite a few music video sets and I've seen how videos turned out. And this is really hard to do. The cinematic quality that they have here is, is so beautiful. Hurry up, don't say maybe. ASAP, baby. What's really kind of interesting too is ASAP for those that maybe don't speak English as a first language. It means as soon as possible. It's like, hurry up, let's go. It's a very urgent feeling, but the track is so relaxed, but they add the urgency with the tick tock tick tock tick tock tick tock It is really, really interesting. Hurry up, don't say, hurry up, don't say, just for a minute. Really beautiful synth work here. Oh, the shot. It's so pretty. This is like the prettiest video I've seen in such a long time. 
Aww. All right, guys, so now that we've watched this video, let's do a lightning round of high notes and low notes, things that I liked about the song and video a lot, and things that I didn't love as much. So first, let's talk about the melody of the song. I think my favorite part is definitely the tick tack tick tack tick 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 It is unironically very much a part that's made to like go viral on TikTok. It's manufactured, it's crafted with that in mind, and it is really, really catchy. So that would definitely be my high note. As far as low notes, I wouldn't call it like low, low notes, but I would say I'm not the biggest fan of the song melodically. I think it's very much like here and nothing really stands out to me other than the TikTok part. Now, don't get me wrong, it's really beautiful and I understand the sort of role of the song on the album. It's more of a relaxing track. It's to kind of give your ear a break between the more banger style tracks. But it's, I would just say this is, it's not my thing. It's a little, it's lacking a little bit of drama, but that that is my personal taste. <laughs> okay, as far as the track, I do think it's a gorgeously produced track. Probably my favorite part is the drums because they hit really, hard while being really, really small. Like if we listen to this part, for example. Do you have the time? Let's talk. The kick is, kick drum is so nice, but it's so tiny, but it really does accomplish what a kick drum should do, which is like punch you in the chest. And I do love a lot of the synth work. It's so like delicate and plays against the vocal very beautifully. As far as low notes, I would just say this is not my favorite style of track, just as far as the genre that this is. I can really respect it and hear how well done it is for what it is, but I probably wouldn't choose to listen to something so minimalistic without there being some point of drama in the vocal or in one of the instruments. As far as vocals, I have to be honest, I don't have high notes or low notes. It's all just kind of like the same for me. Uh, I think the girls did a beautiful job performing it. I think their vocal producers are keeping this really great consistency and through line of a very softly approached airy vocal throughout all of their songs. I think that consistency really creates that new gene sound. So I really, really love and respect that for them. Uh, for me personally, I just think it's not my thing to be that minimalistic, do that little of layering with vocals, especially when you have good vocalists like this. Like I would lo have loved to at least maybe hear this build, right? In this part, for example. There's a lot you could have done, call and responses, like minute, minute, like things like that. Again, it probably is just not a choice for them stylistically, but because this is like what I'm into, for me, it's like hard to get into something that doesn't build that much vocally. And as far as the video, it's like all high notes for me. I absolutely love this video. It's my favorite, as I mentioned, of theirs. I mean, just the sheer artistry of this, the costuming, oh, look at this, it's so pretty. All of the little drawings being added, the subtle bunny imagery, it's good. The video is really, really good. All right, guys, well, now that we've looked at ASAP, let's jump right into Cool With You. Pretty look, I like it. Ooh, models. So it's gonna be a story about these girls. So love this creepy piano. Ooh. What is gonna happen? I'm so interested in this movie. <laughs> oh! <laughs> okay! <laughs> Was she just creeped out? Did she like the guy? <laughs> I don't know what's going on. That look is so pretty with the trailing tall. This is one of the things you guys pointed out in one of our other New Jeans reactions is that they tend to take the narrator role, kind of like telling a story of other people, which I really, really like, you know, 
more often than not artists sing about like their own stuff their own romantic life or their own struggles or whatever it is so it is interesting to see this storytelling aspect which goes so well with their cinematography i've said it before just, i love their videos they are so beautifully filmed produced colored everything ASMR. <laughs> Loving this base already. Oh, the chord progression is great on this. You know me like no other. I like this. This is definitely one of the vibe year songs. As far as just my own personal taste, you guys know I like R&B and everything I produce has like a slant of R&B to it, even if it's more, you know, on the pop side or K-pop side. Um, I just love the chords and the kind of open melodies that are just trailing on top of them in this really relaxed way. It, it's a vibe. I don't know what's going on in the video, but I dig it. <laughs> this is a good melody. So to do a run in the main melody in like a hook is really rare. I've actually done it only once this year. And I remember my collaborators being like, whoa, <laughs> a run in the main melody. But I love it. You just have to have, have a singer that pulls it off. I think the main character, she just wants to date. Is that what's going on? She wants to be in love? What's the best? No way up in the guy is it there? You don't mind the number, it's a dumb energy and a daughter. Who did you do? I like it's relaxed little rap. It's like creepy in an in, in a cool way, right? Because we have these adult characters, like young adults, and then you have these very young girls singing about them, which is almost like the girls are like goddesses or muses or something like they're ageless it, it is really interesting i like the vibe of it i like this melody a lot she dreaming about this guy or is she actually there I think she's dreaming <laughs> they're just on the roof like don't do it girl <laughs> That's a gorgeous shot. Wow, that's so beautiful. This is also really risque for K-pop to have her nude or implied nude, you know? Whoa. Okay, well obviously now we have to watch side B. Uh, to be honest with you guys, I didn't really understand like side A, side B, what that meant, but I think it's going to continue the story and it's gonna have Get Up mixed in as well. Maybe it's like a mashup or maybe it's just two songs continuously. Let's watch this because I need to know what's going on with this girl. I have invested. <laughs> Oh. 
I like, like the performance. Yeah, that's pretty. It's a pretty melody. This reminds me of effects. Is she going to see that guy from the other video? I need to know. Uh, is she is she still naked? Yeah, she's still naked. No, she's dressed. Okay, all right. <laughs> Dreaming, or is that real? Like the camcorder shot. It's beautiful. Oh, that's beautiful. I love the painting of her that he has. He's painted, obviously. Oh no, please don't let one of them get hit by a car. Oh no. Who's that guy? Is that her dad? I see a hitman. <laughs> I'm scared. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Genuine, like my heart is beating fast. I'm like, what is gonna happen? <laughs> Do they not know each other? Did she make all of this up? I need to know. <laughs> Me not paying attention to the music anymore, just fully trying to figure out the story. I don't know why, but this is giving me that like second Twilight movie in Italy, like where the other vampires lived. <laughs> is it supposed to be just in my right ear? Or is my. Oh! oh. I don't know if that was a glitch or it's supposed to be like that. This is a very pretty vibe. So mature for such a young artist. know if she was making up her relationship with the other guy why was she uh in this creepy volturi or whatever they're called <laughs> twilight vampire hangout i need to know i am so confused but as far as my high notes and low notes the things i loved and the things i didn't like i'm gonna say cool with you is probably my favorite track from this ep by new jeans just because it fits like my likes and dislikes the most you know it has the most soulful kind of vibe to it the most r&b chords it still has that house beat which is i would say is not my thing but i think it complements it so beautifully and it really is just such a beautiful lush relaxing vibe as far as my high note for melody definitely the hook melody the, this one It's really interesting. I like melodies that she's really interesting. I don't know if I have low notes necessarily. I would just say some of the other melodies on the verses are not as memorable, but also I always have to preface it. Like my taste likes hook after hook after hook, like really commercial. And this is way more artistic, I would say, than 
where my tastes lie so i don't think it needs to be hooky it's just for me i'm like ah, i want something i can remember from the first listen and the only thing i remember from the first listen is the cool with you melody as far as the track i would say my high note is this bass right here it's a very classic plug deep house bass it's pretty difficult to produce you have to find the right patch and also a lot of the kind of glides have to be really subtle between it or it sounds kind of whack it's, it's really great here and i wouldn't say i have low notes if anything i might have wanted the track to build more in the last chorus but again i don't think that's the style they're going for as far as the vocals it's again the cool with you line i do love when they are add harmonies towards the end i do think it's a little minimalistic for my taste i would have wanted to hear more than just one karma i think it's just one and it is pretty low in the mix uh, but it is lush and gorgeous with the airy textures of their voices there definitely wasn't a low note that's usually if a vocal stands out to me as sort of not fitting maybe being not not very well tuned not very well timed uh, nothing I heard stood out in those ways and I and I wouldn't think in a production of this level and this budget anything would be like that at all so like not surprising it's really quality I mean as far as the video ah, gosh I don't know I love I love it I think it's so interesting and I want to watch this again before I read comments to try to figure out what this means uh, but I do think I love the shot of the girls just dancing and in the previous video I loved all the like random shots of them on the roof and on the balustrade just kind of watching the main character I, I i don't know it just kind of gave me like a scary vibe and i enjoyed it all right guys and that's pretty much my reaction to both the a and the b side of the music video for cool with you as always if you guys have comments if there's something i missed something that you're excited to share about the song and these videos please put it in the comments down below and my girls ellie giselle and i actually did a cover of super shy in seven different genres which is coming out very soon here on the channel so stay tuned for that and on that note i'm gonna go and i will catch you guys next time bye for now